Crystal, and I'm here with my son, John. And this is my first Facebook Live. So if you're watching and you can give me a shout out and let me know that you can hear me okay, I would so appreciate it. Um, I am just hopping on today to talk about my latest blog post that I just posted. And it's all about child feeding. It's something that I'm super passionate about and that's why I have my little guy here with me today to kind of demonstrate some things that I talk about in my blog. So um, again, my name is Crystal. I am a mama of four. Um, this is our youngest, John. He's 10 months old and we also have three, three girls, three older girls. So our kids range from, range from ages 10 months to six, six years old. So it's definitely a busy, busy house. Um, okay, so I wanted to talk about baby led weaning, which is a appro an approach to transitioning um, your baby to solids. And I really like it because it encourages the baby to um, basically kind of learn how to self feed and really eat according to their own hunger and fullness needs. Um, and as you can see here, John is just kind of eating the things that I've set out on his tray for him. And I'm not really spoon feeding him and I'm not, um, thanks babe for watching. <laughs> thanks for the thumbs up. So, um, we bypassed kind of the whole pureed, uh, phase, which never seemed to really work with any of our kids. Um, they never really tuck to the pureed food really well. So doing baby led weaning, it just allows you to kind of feed your baby, of course, foods that are age appropriate. So um, I just have some leftover soup that I made last night and it has a lot of really soft vegetables and meat. And I just kind of fish it out of the broth and give him things that obviously are soft enough for him to kind of mash up and things that he can manage, um, nothing that he can choke on, but still things that he's able to pick up and um, handle with his own fingers and hands. So he's liking this. I'm gonna peel him a little orange too while we're going. But a lot of people um, aren't necessarily as familiar with baby lead weaning. I don't think it's um, as popular as what we know, which is spoon feeding. And I think that's something common that we hear from our doctors and pediatricians. They say, okay, you can start your baby on purees now. Mm. Um, uh, yeah, uh, but that doesn't necessarily give babies the opportunity to explore different textures um, and flavors with, as you would with a pureed food. So. Really, babies are capable of handling a lot of different flavors and textures, and I think the more that we can introduce to them, um, the better for them. I think it really helps them establish a healthier relationship with food, and I think it's a lot less stressful on parents, too. We don't have to sit here and spoon feed them and wonder, you know, if they've gotten enough to eat. They can kind of do it themselves and, and figure out exactly how much they eat, and I think as parents, we really know when our kids have had enough. Um, you know, they'll start playing with their food or they'll try to get out of their high chair. Um, and those are really signals that they have had enough to eat. Another big part of baby led weaning is really including your baby in all of your meals. So for the purposes of this video, I'm just sitting with John right now while he's eating, but usually um, we, incorporate him in our family meal. So he'll be at the table with the rest of us while we're eating. And I actually just try to give him whatever it is um, that we're eating. So, hey Kevin, thanks for joining. Thanks for the support. Um, so yeah, that's kind of the gist of baby led weaning in a nutshell. But I do have my blog post um, that I will share in the comments so you can check out more and I'd love to hear your questions too. So if you have a baby and you're getting ready to transition, transition them to solids, um, what questions do you have? 
And Kevin's asking, what is he eating? So if you're just joining, I am talking about baby led weaning. And John is actually just eating some leftover soup that I made last night. I just made chicken, chicken noodle soup. Um, and there's a lot of soft vegetables and pasta and chicken in here for him. So I basically just kind of put it out on his tray and let him self feed. And again, he's 10 months. So, you know, he is able to sit unassisted. Obviously, um, he has pretty good hand-eye coordination where he can put food in his mouth on his own. And we love it. I think baby led weaning um, and I think there's a lot of misconception about what baby led weaning is. Um, it doesn't necessarily mean weaning. It just means adding complementary solid foods to um, their milk feeding. So whether your baby is breastfed or formula fed, um, adding solid foods is just complementary to that. It's not meant to replace it. Um, and you should continue to breastfeed or formula feed your baby until at least a year. So, so John is still um, breastfed, but we are giving him solid foods between meals. So I hope that answers your question. But if you have any other questions, um, definitely leave them in the comments. I'm interested in hearing your thoughts about baby led weaning. Is it something that you've tried with your own babies? And you can see... <laughs> John's enjoying his lunch here and it does get messy. So, you know, be aware of that. I think a big part of transitioning your baby to solids is just encouraging them and letting them explore um, the food. And that, you know, definitely means getting it all over the place. And, you know, we definitely have messy meals and that's something that I think my husband can attest to. <laughs> We're always cleaning up after the kids, but Ultimately, I think it helps them and encourages them to explore the food and develop a healthy relationship with food. So it's things that they, you know, are learning hands-on. So um, the other thing is that I'm not ever really forcing him to eat. And that's the other thing that I love about baby led weaning is that I'm not trying to coax him to eat more or trying to get more of something in him. That's the beauty about this process. You know, babies innately know how much they need to eat and he is just kind of self-feeding. And I know that when he's full that he'll stop. Um, and so that's kind of a nice part of this too. Let's see, what else can we talk about baby? Okay. Oh, the other thing about baby led weaning is that meals should be really simple. And that's the other thing that I really love about it. Um, you know, when you're doing purees, I think you have to make that extra effort to make all those pureed foods. And then, you know, there's a good chance baby might not like it. Not that there's anything wrong with doing that. Um, I just know for us, we went through a lot of baby food jars initially with our first daughter and she mm. never really took to it very well. So we ended up going out a lot or only using a, a little bit of one. Um, but with baby led weaning, you can really just kind of give them the things that you are eating and that your family is eating. Yeah, I wasn't sure how he was going to do on the camera, but <laughs> so far he seems to be okay. Um, so yeah, again, I will put the link to my blog in the comments if you want to check it out. And I'd love to hear any thoughts or questions that you might have. And I'm going to be trying to go on Facebook Live um, at least once a week here in my um, fan page, Crystal Cargis Nutrition. So I would love if you could join me. And if you like my page, you'll get notified whenever I go live. Um... And let's see. Yeah, here you go. Um, also, if you find that this topic is interesting or has helped you at all, if you can like it or share it with anyone that you think might benefit from it, I would really appreciate it. And next week, I'm going to be talking about... Um, body image for mamas who are postpartum and you know I'm again I'm a mama of four so it's a 
topic that's near and dear to my heart and just like to share some thoughts on that um, with you guys next week. So I hope you can join me. I'll try to put up a notification before I go live. And thanks for joining us again. I'm Crystal and I'm here with my son, John, and we were just chatting about baby led weaning and I appreciate all the support. Hope to see you guys next week.